and women are charged in a Southwest Springfield robbery. It happened with the family sound asleep and the thief snuck into a boy's bedroom with a loaded weapon. Lizzie was barking uncontrollably and it was more of an aggressive bark than normal. So after a few seconds of that, I, I uh, got out of bed and walked towards the front door to see what was going on. That's when Michael Ormsby spotted someone rummaging through his truck parked in the driveway. When I walked past the front door, out of the corner of my eye, I noticed that the truck light was on. So I said, hey, what are you doing? And the guy came around the corner and pointed the gun at me and said, get back in the house. And it took me a second to register, but I slammed the door shut and locked it and ran into the bedroom and told Stephanie that there's somebody robbing us to call the cops. The man ran off, but Greene County deputies arrested the suspect on Wednesday, less than a half hour later, just a couple blocks away. After calling 911, the Ormsby's made a chilling discovery. The danger came much closer than they realized. We started looking around and noticing, you know, purses are missing, uh, wallet was missing, my keys were missing. The man got in through a basement door. No one knew an intruder was inside the home. The man walked into this bedroom, stole the computer off of this desk, then walked over here and grabbed the cash out of this jar, Christmas money, doing it just inches away from where a 12-year-old boy was sound asleep. He woke up but didn't move and got a glimpse of the robber going up the stairs. He's very smart. He actually played possum and he pretended to sleep and uh, which is a good thing. 18 year old Anthony Triggs is now in jail on a quarter million dollars bond. Deputies also arrested 18 year old Alyssa Evans, both booked on robbery and armed criminal action. Court records show Triggs pleaded guilty to a previous robbery and was put on five years probation. Ormsby says officers told him they found drugs on the suspects and that gun was loaded. You know, if Caden would have woke up and, and startled the guy, he could have been shot. The guy had a gun on him. Um, and that really goes for the same for any of us. I never want to be in that situation where I have to, to use a gun or force against somebody. I don't want to have to live with that. But, you know, if, if it's us or them, we need to win. The Ormsby's have since upgraded their home security. Triggs is now charged with burglary, robbery, and armed criminal action. Evans is charged with unlawful possession of a firearm and receiving stolen property. Deputies are now investigating other thefts in that area to see if they're connected. Charges are pending for that deadly crash involving three semi trucks near Stratford. Narinder Singh is